So Jess has an official tryout. Yeah. <laughs> with the Golden State Warriors G League team, Santa Cruz. And Jess and I was having a conversation about what the tryout is like. You don't stand a chance. Yeah. And tryouts, especially for the G League, can either be a, a zoo, but if this is a private tryout, it could be That's really... I think, I think it's a closed tryout, but I don't know. Maybe it is an open tryout. <laughs> I'm not 100% sure, so it's like... Kind of in the air. That, and what makes it tough about uh, open tryout is he may walk in and it may be 100 guys. So it's going to be a lot of cardio and conditioning to weed out who can play or not yeah. based on conditioning shape. That's not good for me at all because I'm out of condition right now. You don't stand a chance. Facts. And then a, a close tryout can be unique because Jess may be going up against guys that just entered a name in the draft. Uh-huh. You don't stand a chance. Guys that got drafted that are no longer on NBA rosters, uh -huh. you don't stand a chance. And overseas guys, so it could be all these guys that are pure hoopers. Yeah, and yeah, you're talking about guys that started for UCLA four years. Mm -hmm. You don't stand a chance. That's your competition in a close tryout. <laughs> so we, we look forward to getting in some great work today and see if we can get them prepared. This tryout is tomorrow. Let's go, Let's go get it. Get it. Yep. One, two, one, one, two. Yep. 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 One, two, one, one, two. One. Yep. Now you had it. Double and then the chain size. Yeah. Yeah. That's it. Now push. Good. Yeah. Yeah. And I'm gonna I'm gonna shadow you as a defender so you get used to handling balls. So when they put pressure, you're ready to go. Ready to keep your base wide. Let's go. Same yep. One, two. No one, more two. excuses. One, two. One, two. One, two. One, two. One, two. Yes. Early. Now move with it. Good. Out one, two. Shape. One, two. One, two. Exercise you got it. Good. No one, two. Time. One, two. Stop six, watching six, TV. Six, six, six. One, Take a social two, media one, six. break. Good, Jess. Push, push, no push, knowledge. push, push, push. Grab a book. There you go. Get ready. Let's go. go. Be knocking off go. Show me the top like that I'm locking that load. I'm ready to go. I'm ready to go. I'm ready to go one, all over the globe. Two, three, one, two, three. One, two, three. Got it. Good. All right. So we were working on ball pressure. So from we'll start from here up. Ball what? Right there. And the only thing we're gonna work on is just your release and your flow. Ooh. Oh, that's pretty good. Now off the ball, DHO. So when, in the trial tomorrow, when you hear DHO, yeah. dribble handoff. So you're gonna be like, oh, I'm ready. Boom, up, inside, we're going into that shot. Ready, we gotta make three of those. Paul, come on for that. There you go, that's it right there. Down, and now when you step, remember when we off the ball. Nice free throw. Goblin squats. That's what you. I don't know. 
nervous for tomorrow. I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> I'm actually yeah, quite yeah. nervous. But you're probably more nervous about ski, uh, about the can, the cardio. Mm -hmm. Yeah, because you got a good skill I set. Yes. I actually feel like, and for all viewers that are watching, that if Jeff just locked in with me for 10 days and we did the 10 day challenge, it would be tough for a lot of you YouTubers out there to come beat him 1v1. Because he's a shooter. So you get your handles and your shot. People will be underestimating me. Remember when I was here and I played KJ? Yeah, won? you won. We I got it on won. film. I almost that played Zaire, almost beat him. Yeah, Zaire. We got you. Oh, one step. Oh. There you go. Perfect. Perfect. And it just up, turn it. Nice, that's one. Give us one more. Oh. Yes, but here's another thing that we gotta be able to do. We gotta be able to shoot NBA threes. It's gonna be what we call a toe tap. Be left, right, up, there we go. Cash, let's do it again. Up, nice, perfect. We got a chance, Jess. We got a chance, baby. Oh yeah, we need one. We got four? We need one. Good job, Jess. Yep, use your base. Feed. Nice. So every part of the court is broken down with some type of verbiage. So from the nipple, we're going to use the shuffle down. So you're going to be shuffling now. If you notice, my feet never crossed. And when I step, I did the same thing that I did at the end of the shot. Now you're just moving on what we call a driving kick. Ready? Get your base and hands ready. Push. Push. That's it. Nice. That's one. Ready, push, up, boom. We need two more. Way to work, up, got it. We need one, up, hey, that's pretty good. All right, all right, settle in class. Welcome back to Motivate tough. University. Be pretty tough. My name is Professor okay. P. Rock. And I'm gonna teach you about muscle memory, hemispheric integration. Nice. Get a brain some to a good habits gonna run like sprinters. Yes. Yes. We got his feet right, we hot. Go, we Corner three. Get a brain some to remember good habits gonna run like sprinters. Spring some a full in the winner. Bad habits gotta go get rid of them. We wanted muscle that memory. shake up. Something telling me, keep this action no repeat. Back to back, one, two, three. Back to back, one, two, three. Back to back, one, two, three. Muscle memory, something telling me, keep this action no repeat. Back to back, one, two, three. Back to back, back to back, back to back, back to back, one, two, three. All right, because at the end of every workout, we normally finish with three. I just need one good bang out for you. Just one bang out. Oh, here we go. go get it. No knowledge. Hey, I'm let's go. I just be knocking off go. Show me the talk that I like and I load. I'm ready to go. I'm ready to grow. I'm ready to go all over the globe. I got the workout in. Honestly, my jump shot is feeling really good. So if they're looking for like a sharpshooter coming off the bench, I think like I'm their guy. But what is your biggest advice for me tomorrow at tryouts? Uh, going into a be prepared for the cardio. You know, back, How do I be prepared for that? Because <laughs> I'm not ready for that. That's going to be, you know, when most people, they go into tryouts, they don't understand that the first way of elimination is through cardio. You know, I think if your cardio is able to hold up and you've been able to be a shooter, you're going to make some waves. Like, that's how you eliminate people in tryouts. And that's brutally honest, to be honest with you. If you're a shooter out there, you, there's always a spot for you on somebody's team. And the way Jess shot the ball today, I feel pretty good. Now, what happens with cardio, when you get tired, you lose all of your mechanics, you lose focus, you don't make the shots that you traditionally would make, which then will affect how good you really can be. All right, so do you think I can make the team? Do you think I'm gonna make the team? Do you think I can make the team? I don't know who's in the tryout. Now, I know the rules of the tryout, the, the rules of the tryout is they normally take maybe two to three guys out of the tryout and they make the team. Now, what if you shot the ball, like today, guys, when we show you the film, Jess made nine out of ten threes. Anybody in the world going into a tryout 
in front of an NBA organization makes nine out of ten threes, they have a chance. Let's go. It, does that make sense? <laughs> Let's go. It's, it's it like, makes sense. They need a shooter. They need a shooter. I so can be a spot up shooter specialist. They, they, they're going to. my role. Role it, play. It's going to force them to have to really think about you. But most people cannot shoot. So if he's not able to shoot, you got to be really quick. You got to be athletic. You have to be blocking shots. You have to do a lot of things. Just don't have to do those things. If he makes nine out of ten threes, they're going to pull him to the side and say, let's at least have a conversation. And that's what being a professional athlete is about. I think people think being a professional basketball player or a professional in, either, in any sport is, is difficult. It's not. It's really about opportunity and preparation. So if you prepare and you get the right opportunity, then you're amazing. And then you got an opportunity. So the answer is like, yes, if I can shoot the ball. If you shoot the ball with precision, you're going to raise questions. Which, <laughs> well, they want to know who you are. Yeah. They want to know who you are. Now, let's say that it's a closed workout. Oh. In a closed workout for a G League NBA team, you're going to run into guys that was already drafted that are no longer in the NBA. They have experience. You, you don't stand a chance. It, <laughs> if, so if it's a close workout, it, I have no chance. It's going to be very tough because, <laughs> because they've, oh. they've tried out their whole life. Yeah, yeah. No, I, I, it makes sense. It makes yeah. sense. But if it's an open tryout, he has a chance because you're going to be going up against what I call the everyday hooper. Mm -hmm. So the everyday hooper is asking the same questions that you're asking now. Yeah. Am I good enough? Can I make it? Uh -huh. Like, what do I need to do? Well, today, you're going to be prepared to go in and be able to shoot the ball right away with cardio. Yeah. Most of them don't know what they're going to do. Uh -huh. They're just hoping yeah. that they can get the opportunity. Close tryout, he's not going to make it because there's going to be too many guys with too much experience and they've played at the highest level. So most people underrate a G League NBA tryout. No, these, this tryout is going to be filled of people that either already played in the NBA, played overseas, played high level college, started in college, won national championships in college. I got some competition today, man. It's going to be. I'm ready, though. Let's get I'm ready. it. I like it. <laughs> Shooting the ball is one of the most critical things that you can do in the game of basketball. If you want to be great at basketball, be a shooter. And if just shot the ball like shit today, uh, excuse my language, if he shot the ball really bad today, then I would say he doesn't have no chance in the open tryout. So the open tryout is what we want. Because we, we want to have the conversation. So open tryout, I got a chance, close tryout, no shot. No shot, because it, <laughs> the, the reason why is because the, the pros You're that motivated. are coming in there, they're going to come in and say, wait a minute. Yeah. Who is like, this who guy? Is this YouTuber? <laughs> and, and so what they're going to do is they're going to go at you. They're going to bully me. They're going to bully you. Okay. They're going to go after you. Hey, and I'm going to try my best. That, that's what it's about. Yes, sir. Let's get it. Appreciate it's the good. love. Appreciate what? always helping me out whenever I need it. It's my guy right here. It's my guy. Go follow my guy. He just got six mil. Make sure he gets another six mil yes. before Christmas. Before Christmas? Why not? Why not? <laughs> Why not? Follow him right now. Hell yeah, that's fine. <laughs> okay. That's perfect. <laughs> Thank you so much. No knowledge? Grab hey guys, look, I told you, nothing but fire. Every day we drop in the best clips, the hottest videos. If you haven't done so, let's do it today. Make sure you ring that bell, turn on your post notifications, and subscribe today. Don't forget, drop your comments below. We want to make sure we're interacting and talking to you and building the best basketball community on YouTube. In the descriptions is everything you need about Just Who. We out. Remember days they ain't really believe in me. Pockets fat, jeans skinny. Motivate the team with me.